Doncic. But the rebound to Lopez. Into the corner, he'll try another one. Rims that out, here come the Wiz. They've only made one field goal, that was a two-pointer by Calderon. Vujicic hanging in the air, scores. Wall will take the open shot, and that's a little bit short. And in the first two games, 50, uh, averaging uh, 25, but more importantly, he's making 51% of his shots. Porzingis, shot up and short, and wall. Corner for three. Carmelo. Wizards turn it over, Wall gets it back with another hustling play. Beal drives on the pass, he's fouled. Good job of outproducing their opponents mm. from the line, John, listen, both. But in many instances, Underway in the third, Steve Buckhantz, Phil Chenier, Chris Miller, our CSN crew. Well, that guy can shoot lights out. Yeah, he's a perfect three for three, so hadn't taken many shots, but when he has, had missed. Pass too far behind Beal and it's picked off. Not a good pass by Gortat. Carmelo baseline got another. Long rebound chased down by Porzingis. Vujicic. And he's called for traveling. Vujicic missed everything. Wall streaking. Gives it up to Gortat. That's rejected. Vujicic down court. And he missed it, but he gets it back and scores. Randy Whitman will take time as the Knicks have opened up a nine-point advantage. And a technical foul has been called. I'm not sure who was on. It might have been on Vujicic. You could just be very proud of about his work ethic. Clearly Harvey is happy because he gets to go to Philly to watch Jeremy. Did he watch Jared? So I told him I said he should do a back-to-back -back with Philly in New York. It'd be great to see both of them. Game for Bradley Beal, including the playoffs. Been very impressive, and especially these last three, how he's come up with those 20 points, especially down the stretch in nitty gritty time. Beal reach in foul. Pretty play. Close. Galloway. Big shot for New York. Dudley. A little strong. Take himself all the way to the basket. 26 for Beal. We're tied at 106. Air ball.